Okay, welcome back everybody. Uh, it's been a hot minute uh, since I've actually shown this on the website because I've been busy dealing with tractor issues. Well, tractor's been fine dealing with uh, attachments and bidding for a barn or having a big barn build. So, uh, Stevens 22410, I uh, got some ammo for it and we've never fired it. And uh, why do I need a Stevens 22410 for the uh, reference collection? because I thought it was cool. It's, uh, for those of you not familiar, it is an over under 410 shotgun on the bottom and a 22 long rifle. Might even be 22, what does it say? Uh, it does have uh, three inch chambers. Does it say? You know what? I'm assuming that is, well, you know what, with all the, uh, Tina, it's hard to read. So, uh, you know, it's a little squirrel gun, and unfortunately, I don't have any uh, any bird shot. I've got a uh, uh, 410. It's uh, it's four shot uh, Remington. Uh, you know, the the I guess you call it ball. You know, buck and ball. So, um, I'll shoot this on. Uh, the plate rack, if I can hit it, hopefully the, the um, you know, the 410 shot shells, maybe because they're not going fast enough, hopefully they don't bounce around and break the glass on my new tractor. That would suck, but it's going in tomorrow anyway. So uh, we'll do this, and then we'll do some single shots with 22s, and maybe we'll shoot some uh, pop cans with the two. The light is, the light is failing fast, so let's, as you can see, there is the sun going down. All right, how's that for fancy, fancy, uh, all right. It's gonna be more of a, four ten. the uh, past year or so has been pretty hard to come by, so. Ready to clean these out and show this up close. Ears on. And I don't make sure we're down. I'm sure that's correct. Then we'll cock it and you know what? Just to be safe, I'm gonna do ye oldie uh, ye oldie left hand. didn't blow up and yeah how cool is that there you go let's see you can see the plates I don't know how far I don't know probably 15 18 yards let's see if uh let me see if I can hit the man the silhouette first you know what hold on what did I do Oh, you know what? It goes to the top one. That'd be an impact. Try it again. Interesting. Every time, every time I crack the action open, it um, it resets to the top. Make sure you can see me. Oh. And so, watch this. <clears throat> Let's close it up. The selector, this is the selector, and it's 22 up top, 410 at the bottom. Watch it go down. See, I guess it always <clears throat> defaults to up. So let's try, let's try a plate. I saw it move. Hopefully you can see me. You might not be able to. Let's <clears throat> move the camera. Oh, 
I hit the plate. Let's try. Let's try the uh, the tree. Oh, let's see. Hold on. Select her down. Does have a manual arm you're gonna have to get used to. Which I wouldn't know if I hadn't bought it. It moved it. It's hitting that tree. All right. Stevens 22410. Let's uh let's try the uh, 22. I have some uh, standard velocity Remington. 22 target this is what's the bullet weight on this is it 40 or is it less 40 40 gram 40 uh 40 gr okay it's 40 all right so basically standard 22 let's shoot at the silhouette Kind of jumped on that a little bit. Hit this, hit the, uh, hit the silhouette. It's uh, oh, exposed lead ammo, and so I'm not a, you know, I prefer uh, copper washed or copper ammo. But I'm gonna try a shoot. Oh, something's up. Hold on. Ejector does not look right. See how far that's sticking out? 22 ejector. So that would be an angle. Does that lift out? There's a little set screw. I think the ejector is turning. So I turn the ejector so it would uh it would work. Alrighty. Yeah, a little weird with the ejector. That might need to go back onto the bench. Let's go and show this. So there's the ejector. That looks like a set screw for the ejector. And what's happened is, if you can help bump in the camera, you can see that the ejector turns. And so if it's not recessed into that groove, it won't it won't close into battery. So that makes complete sense. So here's another little screw. There's actually two screws there. So the screws are present, so hopefully that's not an issue. Let's see if that does not look good to me. Let's see if that will no. There we go. Yeah, the ejector is, <clears throat> and I gotta be careful with this because I don't want to break it because getting parts for this would be pretty much impossible. And one more. All right. So there we go. Stevens 22410. See if this will close. <clears throat> so there it is closed. There's the ejector in the, in the proper position. Stevens 22410, uh, first shots. We'll go ahead and get it uh, worked on in the armory and tear it down and see what's going on with that ejector. And if you want to see more stories or pictures or links, everything we discuss, in particular this gun, please go to john1911.com. That's J-O-H-N-1911.com. Remember, it's all about shooting guns and having fun. Everybody, have a good day.